Here's a demonstration of how the overloaded methods program should work. You're going to ask the user to somehow indicate if they are a business customer or a residential customer. I'm asking them to put in a number. And I'm going to say one. And then I'm going to enter the business name, contact name, phone number. Now if I run it again, and this time I'm going to deliberately use the wrong number, you should include error checking, and I'm going to do the residential customer. Now that there are two methods with the exact same name but different signatures because they're accepting different parameters. So you should make sure to include all of these components in your homework program. You should do the error checking, you should include some comments to describe the program, and you should make sure it works roughly the way this one does here.